What's up everyone, Danny Lightning back with another War Robots video. Today we are going to be checking out some really weapons, some really weapons, some really awesome weapons, I should say. The Nucleons, the Atomizers, and Quarkers, these are some older weapons that are performing great. Honestly, you might want to build a set of these. So we're going to do some gameplay, we're going to review these, we're going to tell you some pluses and minuses and all kinds of stuff like that during the gameplay so we can figure out if these are something you might want to play. They have a 500 meter range, they do decent damage, and after you shoot for so long, they don't really have a reload, but they overheat and then the bullets start spreading all over the place, so you take your finger off the trigger, you let them cool down, and the cooldown is really fast, so that's one big advantage. It only takes, what, like, maybe two seconds to cool down or something? These weapons are doing it right now, so let's go do some gameplay. We'll check them out, then we'll talk a little more about these after the gameplay. So let's go do it to it. If you need some awesome audio plugins or new gear to create your content, check out the video's description in the pinned comment. With these particular weapons, I'm going to say this Typhon is currently the star of the show. I mean, the Typhon is doing great. The other weapons, or the other robots, are doing really good with these weapons installed, but Typhon is out there kicking some butt. So let's head into the center, and we're going to kind of play him as a support right now. We're going to hang back. We're going to help our teammates clear off the beacon as they're trying to take it. So anybody who comes up this way... We are going to zippity zap them with our atomizers, our quarkers, and our nucleons. I mean, of course, we don't have all three on this robot, but we do have a whole hangar set up. Well, a couple robots set up with those weapons. So we're just going to hang back, right? Let's go get this guy. He's trying to steal my beacon. Hey, dude, get out of here. Get out of here. If you put that go skill on this robot, it moves really fast. You lose the ability, but it's worth it for the extra speed. I mean, the extra speed is insane. All right, they stole my kills. They stole my kills. Hey, it's not very nice, teammates. All right, so I could probably have, like, so many more kills, but my teammates always steal them. All of my kills. That's what happens when you play with a bunch of good players, man. They steal all your stuff. They steal all your stuff. All right, let's go back up the ramp and help center out. I think we need... Oh, no. Oh, God. All right, that's one of the problems when your robot's really fast is sometimes you get unwanted jump action. That's not what you're going for, but this thing's been tearing people up. So I've been playing these weapons for a couple of days now, and I'm going to tell you what, they are excellent. If you don't have some of these, build, start building these in the workshop. Start building these things in the workshop because they are very, very, very good. We got the double kill. We got it, we got it, bam, smushed them. And I'm gonna tell you what, it's not always fun standing in the back like this and just kinda, you know, playing peekaboo, shooty shooty peekaboo doody doody or something like that. I, I I don't know, don't ask, I say weird things. But uh, I'm telling you, these weapons are just kicking major butt. I'm very impressed. Now, the heavy version of this Somebody made a chart recently, and I'm not really sure if this is correct, but the chart says the heavy version of these weapons do more damage per second than any other weapon in the game. Now, the coolest thing about these is you don't have to reload at point blank, right? Now, at a distance, they overheat, and then the bullets start spreading all over the place, and you're not going to hit nothing, but if you're close enough to the enemy, it doesn't matter if they're, if they're overheated. You can just keep shooting and shooting and shooting and you're never going to run out of ammo if you're close enough all those all that ammo is going to hit and you never have to reload all right so there's a ming up there guys i know a lot of you think ming's a crappy titan but the ming will beat you up right the ming is a that's a good ming player he, he's hiding in the right spots he's very hard to hit that's somebody that knows what they're doing with the ming right a Ming is very dangerous in the right hands. So we need to we need to take that thing out. We need to get rid of that guy, which is very hard to do. I mean he's making it so it's almost impossible to hit him, so he's playing that thing perfectly. Alright, we gotta get this guy. This guy is causing me all kinds of issues. And I don't like it. I don't like it at all. No, 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 no. Get your Ming out of here, dude. I'm kind of like looking around, you're like, like, oh yeah, that's gonna help me see around the corners, right? 
So there's the Amugi portal. I don't want to go through that, but I've been gravity craplified. Guys, you got to build a Typhon. Typhon is a cool robot. You can build all of this stuff in the workshop currently. Uh, right now, I do have the Keystool drone on it, but even without it, even without it, it's really good. You don't need to have that thing. You can throw a beak on here. You can throw, uh, you could, man, maybe not reviver, but you can throw just any decent drone on here, and it's gonna do great. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Bam! Smashed. Oh crap! I got beat up by Titan. All right, let's go ahead and bring our next robot in. Oh man, I dropped the wrong robot. I wanted to show you robots that have the other weapons on there, but I dropped the wrong one. Right. I got a Fenrir set up, and I got a Kepri set up with these weapons. So when the next robot drops in, it'll have these weapons on it. If the game lasts that long. I mean, we got five minutes left, so I'm pretty sure this thing will die beforehand. But we got to get rid of this dumb Titan. Get out of here, dude. Da -da 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 die, Mr. Titan. Boom, smash. Boom, 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 smash. Threw him in the trash. Yeah, smushed him. All right, here comes some more Titans. This is a little bit scary right now. That Ming is still back there, guys. That, ah, oh, we finally got him. Death to Ming. Ha, 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 ha. Death to Ming. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, crap. Death to me. All right, let's go and bring in Mr. Kefri. He's got the four light weapons set up. And I'm going to tell you what, these things are just really packing a punch. Yeah, we got one. We got one. Let's try and smush this Titan really quick. Even the lights, man. Four lights is very strong. These are really good. Right now, those weapons are overheated, so we got to let them cool down. The good news is the cool down is really fast, but it, it sometimes it's... Wait a second. Is that is that another Ming? Or is that the same guy? I thought we killed him. Aw, oh, man. There's another one back there. Maybe it's the same dude. I don't know what we killed, but I could have swore I saw that Ming die. Now, what was I saying? I don't remember, but let's just keep shooting at these things and smash their faces. We're going to blow your butt off, sir. Prepare to die. Ha <laughs> ha, get him. All right, hold on, hold on. We got a whole mess of crap going on back here, so yeah. We got to take care of these dudes trying to steal the beacon really fast. It looks like our team is definitely winning, so that's good. That's good. Double kill. Nice, nice. Nice, nice. Man, I'll tell you what. It looks like we're about to lose this one. Wait a second. What's going on? We don't have any beacons? They're stealing all the beacons. Are we going to win? Are we going to lose? I don't know. We're going to find out. But you know what? I don't care to show you games where we only win or we only do really well because that's not realistic, guys. On this channel, I like to show you games where whatever happens, happens. So, hey, whether we win or we lose, you're going to get to see this game footage, right? And holy crap. Are you kidding me? Well, there you have it. We lost. But these weapons performed awesome. These weapons performed great. Look at that. 4.4 million damage, 7 kills, 5 beacons. I came in first place. Now, this score sheet came from a different game, but take a look at this. This is the kind of crap I usually have to put up with. He stole all my kills. He stole all my damage. Man, Artemis. Gosh. Look him up on YouTube, guys. He's got a uh, cool channel. He runs the YouTube wiki page. And yeah, anyways, he stole all my kills. All right, let's get back to these weapons and talk about these really quick. I've played these on all kinds of robots after the last couple of days. But man, I'm telling you what, the Typhon is it. The Typhon is really just good. Like really, really, really good with these particular weapons. This is probably one of my new favorite builds right now. I don't know, I mean, I've been playing the Typhon with the lasers, the, the new spike harpoon weapon thingies, and I like these. I like these better than all of them on the Typhon. You can get all three of these in the workshop, or if you really want to, you can buy them with gold. I mean, it probably takes about three weeks to build a weapon if you do the daily thing in the workshop, or you can just dump the gold if you want to. 
All right, well, I think that's going to wrap this video up. Don't forget to check out the video's description and the pinned comment. There's some affiliate links that will help support the channel. If you drop down the video's description, there's some other ways to help support the channel. I just hit the microphone. You don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. But if you need some cool audio or video gear for your YouTube channel, podcast, or anything, there's an awesome Amazon link. There's some Waves plugins. Oh, my God, I just did it again. I suck. I suck. But if you need some Waves audio plugins for editing audio, check that affiliate link out. Um, there's my YouTube channels, my Discord server, and a bunch of other stuff in the description as well, plus some game news. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are amazing. Lighten it out. See ya.